I am gonna be doing a get ready with me. I haven't done this. Just, oh. See, I haven't done this in such a long time. So there's going to be a lot of fumble and mumbles. Fumble mumbles. But yeah, you guys are welcome back to my channel. If you're new or if you didn't know, I've heard a lot of people say if you didn't know. But if you didn't know, my name is Akusia Behini. You're most definitely welcome to my channel. Also, I'm gonna be using a few new products that I got in some packages and also bought with my money so as and when i do need to mention a product that is new on here i will do that and i miss you guys so much so don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you are new hey yeah you guys like i have a lot of new followers like i have a lot of new subscribers hi let's do a reintroduction okay like, let's do a reintroduction Hi, my name is Akusia Behini Anan. I am married, I have a kid, I have one child. I live in the US. I am originally from Ghana, but I live in the US. I do beauty videos, lifestyle videos, which includes vlogs and sometimes sit down talk videos. And yeah, just anything that I feel like is worth sharing on my channel, I share it. Valuable content, of course. So yeah. For my new followers, my new subscribers, you guys are welcome. I'm a nice person. You guys are nice too. Don't go nowhere. Subscribe, turn on the bell button so you don't miss any videos. Our posting schedule on here is Wednesdays and Saturdays. Saturdays, Saturdays, however you want to call it. But our posting schedule is Wednesdays and Saturdays. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. Woo! So i went ahead to spray some of this power up this is a power up dual face setting mist to sort of rejuice everything that i have on my face because it's, it's afternoon time here and i don't want to reapply my moisturizers so this just sort of revives your skin so i'm gonna go ahead and use my primer i'm using the fenty beauty primer so where have i been i have been around I have been creating content but i have been stressed and as a result i haven't felt like myself and like i haven't felt like and i know that's not a good thing to do i'll say to the other time i feel like we only like youtubers will only wait to have a good life before they sit in front of the camera to record but i don't want it to be like that again because i realized that life's problems will never go away you will always be battling something you always be dealing with something so i am not going to do that again i'm not going to sort of sit around and just like wait for everything to be okay before i come here to create content i feel like that's not fair so yeah i honestly have been stressed and i have a vlog which my moving vlog i said in the beginning that i've been stressed because one i miss my daughter who's in ghana and i'm here that's the biggest thing so as a mom it stresses me a lot like i just cannot wrap my mind around the fact that there's a pandemic and my child is on in is in another country and i just don't know when the world i just didn't know when the world was going to sort of come back around so it put me in a really really bad place and my mind was just beginning to scatter for a foundation i'm gonna try a new foundation today i'm trying the maybelline super stay 24 hour foundation is this a super stay yes this is a super stay this i've i've heard a lot of people talk about it i've never tried it i have one maybelline from maybelline foundation that i've i always use so hopefully i like this one as well so also the like i said the big 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 thing was that i was dealing with stress of the pandemic and the fact that i missed my child so much another thing really was that we were moving or changing location we're moving from our old apartment to a new one so there was just like within just like a short period of time we had to deal with a lot of things if you use me as a shade reference i i'm using the shade java it's the same shade that i use in the other maybelline foundation shade which i feel like a slightly darker 
but it's okay because I like for my concealers to be much more lighter so we were dealing with a pandemic the world was going through a lot and as you guys know obviously if you're on the internet you obviously know that we were also dealing with this whole BLM Black Lives Matter issue and it was just like really really crazy it was a lot there was so much going on and everybody just kept saying that 2020 was just like too much there was too much going on in 2020 like people just couldn't take it and personally i was dealing with my personal life problems and i was also dealing with pandemic and being a black person living in america so it was just like a lot it was just like a lot but god being so good every time i say this like we're settled now we finally moved if you haven't watched my empty apartment tour obviously you guys can tell by my different background we finally moved everything is like cool done like I mean not like the apartment is not totally done but we've moved and when i can say that i'm in a good place to even film videos again so i was dealing with my life itself was dealing with a personal pandemic <laughs> so yeah so foundation is done now i'm gonna go ahead and use my elf concealer this is elf hydrating camo concealer in the shade deep caramel like living here and dealing with this whole black lives matter and this whole thing that happened actually was a revolution for me you know so much changed in my mind with how i think generally i feel like people are not even talking about the fact that this thing really is a revolution for a lot of black people especially black content creators because we are the ones with like the voice on the internet and it just really put me in this place where i'm like as black content creators or as a black content creator what am i doing with my platform there's so much vehicle noise here but yeah i just kept asking myself what am i doing with my platform what am i doing to make a difference as a black content creator you know because like let's just be honest the tall and short of the story is a lot of the times like before a lot of black content creators came into the scene we were always watching these white people and then white content creators and picking a lot of these tips from them hair tips and everything and now we have our people in the space and majority of the times they're literally doing the same things that the black the white content creators are doing so you can't even like you can't even tell the difference you can't tell that this is a proper black content creator doing things for black people so i actually wanted to do a whole video and term or name it dear black influencers because i feel like we have the platform now we have the influence we have the audience and we have to tell our story that's the only way we're going to be here that's the only way we're going to stand out that like we have to put our money where our mouth is like we have to promote black brands like we have to let the black girl out there know that it's beautiful to be black it's beautiful to wear makeup as black and still make it look like yourself you know like i was just having a lot of things going on in my mind i just like really wanted to record but then i wasn't in a good place of like i, I just wasn't in a good space to sit down and even talk so i've been doing a lot of thinking and i like i said this was a huge revolution for me in all honesty i feel like I have the platform i have the audience what can i do to make a difference as a black influencer and as a woman like a black woman in this space what can i do with my space and moving forward i just really really want to do a lot of things that will serve my black people because like really i'm a black person before anything else i know the whole social media space it's not like you don't just have black people watching you and you have a lot of people who might be looking at you and watching you and doing blah 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 but you know like i'm a black person before anything else this concealer dries so fast oh my god hopefully i didn't mess it up okay guys so i decided to do a lot before coming back because i didn't want the video to be long so this is essentially the eye look that we're going to be creating in today's video the look is literally products from my boxy charm last month or in june so may 
boxy charm may my may boxy charm box what am i talking about so i'm just gonna go ahead and start off the eye look the concealer or the primer that i use for my eye is the elf camo concealer in the shade light beige this is super super light and i bought this this is also new i bought this because i wanted my eyeshadows to show up a lot more so yeah so like i was saying henceforth i'm going to be using my platform to do a lot of black girl stuff okay like if you're looking for black girl in full glory please just don't think twice come over to my channel i'm going to be doing a lot of looks that I like black girl friendly i'm going to be you know basically like i'm a black girl so like what else you know so like i said this whole thing i feel like 2020 itself was a revolution in like in itself like the year itself came with so much revolution in our lives in the country in the world like everywhere like everybody that you call or everybody that you speak to over the phone tells you something like i'm dealing with this or like it hasn't been easy or like like it just hasn't been easy on everybody so everybody has a story during these times i feel like th this year really hit everybody different but trust me guys when i tell you that i still have so much positivity in me like i feel like all hope is not lost and i want you guys to feel the same too if you're there and you feel like 2020 has been very shitty everything that you touch isn't working everything that you do is just like messing up your job is messed up like your finances are messed up everything is messed up trust me boo when i tell you there is still light at the end of the tunnel like you're still gonna get through it you're still going to see yourself through 2020 and at the end of 2020 you will look back and say wow i did that like i am gonna say that i want you to say it and i know you're gonna say it to like 2020 the heaviness is slowly going away and hopefully you guys feel it too like it was so heavy but god being so good and the universe being so generous the heaviness is slowly moving away and now everything is beginning to come back under control so that's a good thing so for my eyes i'm gonna use the violet boss essentials palette i got this from my boxy charm long time ago box i'm gonna use the brown black shade cinnamon black and dusty rose so yeah so i'm not going to talk <laughs> i'm just going to rush through this i i look like I have essentially said everything like i was dealing with life i was dealing with being a mom and having my child live in a different country and be in a different country i was also dealing with the fact that there's a pandemic and i don't know when the world was going to come back to being normal again so i was just like in a bad place but like i said hopefully i mean like thankfully everything is falling in place now the world feels a little better now how are you guys dealing with life comment below if like you want us to chat like i will be down below right now so comment below if you guys want us to talk about how you guys have been dealing with the pandemic and also like i said i'm going to be putting up videos every wednesdays and saturdays i'm going to be living to that promise i'm also going to be doing vlogs weekly vlogs because i promised that's at the beginning of the year and i intend to live by that promise like i said life's problems will never go away so i don't know like i'm not gonna wait i'm just going to keep creating content whenever i have a problem i will come here and tell you guys how i feel and how generally i feel like i'm not okay and maybe i need to step away for a little bit anything anything that i feel like i have to share with you guys i won't hesitate to share it with you guys because at the end of the day i'm creating the, the like all these videos because of you people and 
I love the relationship that majority of you have with me. A lot of you are able to reach out to me, tell me what kind of videos you want to see and everything. And I really, really love that. So I want to maintain that relationship. And by so doing, I have to put out content. So I'm going to do that. So yeah, this is basically the around. I'm going to cut the crease and come back and then we'll do the glitter part. Okay, so next I'm going to set my whole face with my Maybelline powder in the shade 370. You guys know that I've used this powder for such a long time. So I absolutely love it. Um, and then I'm just going to set my face. I'm going to go ahead and set my whole face with this power up. Power up setting spray. So, this is essentially the whole look. I'm gonna put on my lashes, finish off the rest of my face, and then I will come back and we're going to chat a little more, and then that's it. Okay, guys, so this is the entire look. This is how the look turned out. I actually really like the lip color let me tell you guys about the lip color i wasn't so sure about it so i didn't know if i should show you and then i wasn't gonna put it on and you know like i just really wanted to be sure of what lip i was doing before i showed you guys so it's the milani this is it it's the milani amor mate or amor mat i don't know however you want to call it but this is essentially the lip shade that I am wearing today. This is how it looks like. It's a nice purple pink vibe and it dries down really fast, like really fast. So it's very good at like sculpting your lips and like getting a shape. But we have mistake, mommy. I want to go and one okay so so yeah mm, where's my nose doing that <laughs> yeah so yeah this is basically the whole look like i was saying before i lost my train of thoughts moving forward i want to use my platform to do a lot of black girl shit like i'm not even trying to joke like i want to do a lot of black girl shit things that is things that black girls do like what we live for like the kind of makeup that we do the kind of nails that we do the kind of lifestyle that we live because i'm a black girl before everything like i said also moving forward like i said this is a whole revolution for me and i'm just praying and hoping that i get a lot of black brand deals black deals that i can share with you my people so that it would just like make sense because we have white influencers who do things for white people and i'm not even joking I have some white beauty channels that I've never seen before, but they have a lot of followers and which makes me know that they have a lot of people from their people, their, their, their community that supports them. So one other thing that I'll say is let's support our black influencers. They're trying, they're doing everything within their possible best to make black influencing a thing. So let's support our black influencers as much as we can. And like I said, I'm going to, put myself down just so that i can be able to do a lot more content that serve black people so i hope you guys like this video this is literally what i've been up to this is what my life had been up to i was moving apartments so i was super super busy and doing stuff also life was stress stressful like i i'm dealing with a lot of things you know honestly but like i said life's problems will never go away and like you can never really say that i'm waiting for the perfect time because there's never a perfect time to execute anything so anything that you have plans to do anything that you have planned you've written down anything that you want to start start now because the universe will never stop moving the problems will never stop coming and you gotta start now okay so yeah thank you guys so much for watching this video i love you guys so much subscribe to my channel turn on the bell button so you don't miss any video when i upload i also would love if you comment down below on this video in case you have any video idea for your girl and i'll see you guys in my next video Bye.